Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more Undermine, Undermine, Streaking Time. Ooh. Okay. I was gonna say whatever opened up this, whatever uh, upgrades we got when we opened up that, we're going to determine what we got here. Looks like it maybe is gonna be a throw run, and you can't pass up our. Uh, we've been doing so many Omega Lol runs that I feel like just whatever. Uh, and then Relic Eater. We will just make sure we remove it. Easy as that. But alas. <laughs> Shout out to Patreon supporter Bingus Town USA. Probably my fa my favorite peasant name that we we get to say now. Uh, yeah, thank you to Bingus Town USA for supporting on Patreon, getting your name on a peasant, and helping support the channel. Anybody the five dollars tier higher gets the name on a peasant. You know the drill. Link at the top of the description. You can go take. Oh my God. Well, it's a shame that that's gonna go away. It's a bigger shame that I don't care. Don't really care. Let him break it. See if I can. I'm not gonna, I ain't gonna use it. Well, okay, do okay. Um, okay, so first things first, Vegas Town USA. We are gonna pop on up to the uh, the shrine that we do know exists. Oh god, this is this is already a run, baby. We gotta go fast though. Like uh, uh, not really. I was gonna say we gotta make sure we we remove our <laughs> <laughs> or curse at the uh, the shrine and not take any curses until then. Not really particularly the uh, exact same thing as saying going fast, but you know what I'm saying, right? Sure, now that I've explained it thoroughly, otherwise there'd be no chance. But alas, I just woke up. It's probably clear. I got half a brain, but yet I'm here. Relic Eater, get out of here. There we go. And I am certainly going to go back and honestly, wait. Interesting choices could be made here. Interesting choices indeed. We could get the two major curses. Boom. We get that for free because of Aura. We may actually be able to get Omega Lull. On the next floor, if anything. What do we get? Uh, honestly, that sucks. I hate, I hate that a lot. I don't know why I even purchased my way in here. Just so I could be disappointed to see that we will not be able to afford overstock unless we get a hundred bucks in here and then I made a big old mistake. Nope, certainly did not. All right, down we go, down we go. All right, good stuff, good stuff. Uh, huh. There is, there's a chance that uh, we can generate Omega Lull yet. Planting a bomb costs two bombs. Okay. Like of all penalties to get right now, that one, like, it's annoying, but I think we'll be able to get rid of it without too much trouble. And right now we have a 20%, maybe even a 25% chance to get Omega Lol. Which, I'll be honest, on an Aura run, as soon as I pick up Aura, I kind of, like, write off my chances of getting it. Okay. Okay. But okay. Oh, shoot. I broke it. Ah, you piece. I wanted to get cursed. Maybe there's a secret one back here. Nope. Yep. That's, uh, you know, that's the problem with Ricochet. You're gonna, you're gonna hit everything whether you want to or not. Oh, that was close. You can have that. You can have that money. You can have it. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's a curse room here, too? Okay. Well, absolutely, I'm going to do, be doing that. There's a curse room here, too. This is wild. Oh, why does it all have to suck? Oh, no. Is there a reroll anywhere? Do we still have... Wait. Oh, no. Oh no. Is this the curse that's bugged? I think it might be the bug cursed. The one that does not ever actually technically go away? I could be. Oh boy. Ooh, I don't know about this, my friends. Oh no. The good news is, we know for a fact that we have the bomb immunity on our pedestal. So. 
just saying there's a chance. Just wanted to double check what was here. All right, um, okay. Ooh. Should we just get cursed for the sake of getting cursed so we can try and get Omega Lull? Fine. All right, so we should have like a 30 plus percent chance. Yeah, I'm gonna say that's not, that's not 100. And here's the annoying thing. We do now have to wait all the way until Other Mine 4 to have a chance to find Omegalol. That is the annoying thing. And the other thing is, I kind of... Alright. This is kind of a bummer as well. The fact that I gotta put on my immunity because we're just gonna reduce our chances. Should I care that much about it? Probably not. But the fact that, that we have uh, U235... We got the U2 means we could super realistically have a bomb run because I know we have bomb immunity waiting for us at some point in the run. We don't know when it's going to when it's going to show up, but we know for a fact it will. So, yep. God, that curse needs to be fixed. The bomb uh, the, the chest trap curse accidentally like I don't know what kind of oopsie it is, but it just there's an oopsie that makes it so it never actually gets removed when you remove it, which is obviously a massive problem because it's one of the more annoying curses. It's really, it's genuinely one of the more annoying curses. So that really, uh, oh, it bungles it up. Oh, it bungles it up. I ain't gonna fight that. All right, we could just stand still forever and make Aura run out so we get the the curse later. Did we get enough money? Yep. Well, now we got enough money to remove the curse if we want to. I think I do, because if we're gonna be doing a bomb run, we're gonna need to get rid of power shortage. Powder short. Powder. Powder shortage. Powder. Blah, 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 blah. I just woke up, please. I never record. I like. I, I gotta be honest. I it's. Let's uh. Let's pull the curtain back. It's like it's 9 a.m. in the morning right now. I typically don't start recording until like 11, maybe noon. Because I typically, you know what? Here's the behind the scenes retromation episode. Hey, here's the the, the day in the life TikTok. Oh my god, but actually talking. You know, this is fine. We actually hard counter him. Not really. We, we counter him. We can blow ourselves up with a bomb and insta-die, practically. We, we do hard counter him. I would consider Ricochet to be a hard counter. But, maybe if I'm distracted by... <laughs> Eat my booty, you jerk. I typically, uh, I typically record, yeah, around like 11 o'clock is when I start. You know, when my videos go up, I, I wake up, I put up my videos. I put my videos up already, so I was like, you yeah, know, sure, fine. Let's let's see what this is like. This whole recording at 9 a.m. in the morning. What could that? What could that? Oh, God, just just bite me. I'm bad at video games at 9 in the morning. That's all I'm getting at. So I don't know why I would pick Undermine, something that genuinely does need my uh, like <laughs> reaction attention. I typically, I don't know. I find it much easier for me to uh, play strategic games like Astronarch or uh, I, I often I'll play like a team fight tactics game is the second I wake up. I play a ranked team fight tactics game the second I wake up. Whoop. Just to, to wake up the old, the old noggin. But then, yeah, then I'll, I'll go and record. Typically, I, I, I wait a little bit to start, though, because I want to make sure that I'm actually going to be good at the video games. Not today. Not today. Today, I want to be bad at the video game. Let's get it, baby. So, do we really, like, do we want to just sit here for 12 years? No, because both of those curses suck. Like, I hate both of those curses so much. So, I'm actually, I, I'm... 
I'm happy to reduce our chance. First of all, I don't even know. Like, it, sometimes it feels like the, these chambers don't even change your percentage chance. I could be wrong. It'd be kind of cool if they just had no impact. And that might be the case. But it, worst comes to worst, reducing our chance by 5% is fine by me. I'm going to try and sneak a an Omega Lull and get one to show up by... Uh, if we can get one on this floor or next floor, great. After that, I'm not really going to be... Uh, I'm not going to try and force it or anything. Cool. We can, we can get a fine fine amount of value out of that, I think. I stink, I stink. We kind of want to place a couple bombs so that we constantly will have this number underneath our HP number. Because if we get hit by a bomb right now, we, uh, we don't die, which is good. But boy, it's close. I feel like there's a secret room over here. Yep. Thanks. Goodbye. Wah, wah, wah. Wah, 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 wah. Goodbye. All right. So we got gold, gold, gold. Gold, gold. It's all right. Getting gold from day to night. That actually gave me nightmares. Gotta be honest. Gotta be honest. Oh, uh, boy. All right. We're fine here. We got our we got our shrine. We're not gonna lose any Omega Lull chance from it. Kind of want to explore just a hair. See if there's any kind of like cursed, uh, cursed fire, cursed shrine, cursed whatever the hell. See if we can squeak out something like that. Oh, interesting. Duel room. Time to d d d d d duel though. Cirque the Soleil, huh? It's a good item that I just don't really like using. That's kind of where I'm at with it. It's like there's nothing wrong with it, but sometimes it just does. It, it, I, I think my issue with it is just it's too buggy for me to to rely on it. I think that a lot of the bugs have been fixed, but it's still... It might even be, like, the concept of the fact that it was buggy is genuinely what keeps me... Keeps me from thinking about it... Yeah, as a, as a true slapper. Alright, so... Here's the thing. We could get SAR bombs, and this could finally be the day that we use them. We could get pocket bombs, we could get... Uh, basically, there's an extreme amount of bomb items in the Omega Lull room. There's also an extreme amount of danger until we get that bomb immunity. So, I'm probably going to just play the ricochet throw game until we pick up our bomb immunity. That is waiting for us on the shrine wherever the hell. And of course, it doesn't matter. I'll pick that up. It's it's early-ish. That was what? Other mine 4? So, yeah. Man, it's, I'm not going to say that I'm excited. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not going to say... I'm not going to say... I, I, I didn't say I was going to say something else. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got a secret room to the left. Got a room that we uh, need to use keys to get into. This is multi-purpose. One, it, it gets us in there using a bomb instead of a key because we have more bombs. Two, I don't want to freaking die. I want to make sure that, as I mentioned, I want to make sure that that is lower. What is this, man? It keeps going. It just keeps getting deeper. Secret Roomception. I can't. I, I gotta. I gotta lay it on the table, gang. I do not like this joke. Let me explain why. It's. It feels like it's entirely missing the point of the word. Like I get it. Like people are just like they. I'm saying it because of the. You know, it happened in the movie Inception. But Inception would. It's not like. <laughs> Inse Inception is not something being inside of something else. <laughs> like, 
That's not what inception the word inception means. <laughs> you know? That's not just not what it means. <laughs> it's just I don't know. It, it doesn't make me mad, but I just don't like the joke. Uh, <laughs> I just don't like the joke anymore. I'm a curmudgeon. I'm a freaking curmudgeon. Whoop. But alas. Inception blew my mind is another thing, you know? Total, uh, total mind mess. I mean, like, it's not, I don't know. This is not me, like, tooting a horn or anything, but it's just kind of like... <laughs> it's, it's, not, it's not that complicated of a movie. <laughs> if you just... <laughs> If keeping it, 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 it is if keeping track of like a couple, <laughs> just like a couple like uh, layers. <laughs> if that's if that's troubling, then yes, I guess it's complicated. It's not it's not that complicated though, and this is not a toot my own horn thing. This is I I don't believe that you genuinely think it's that complicated either. It may be one of the more complicated movies that got popular. I guess one of the more mainstream movies to be semi-complicated indeed yes should we go into there I don't think so eh eh we could try I, I genuinely this is one of the weird days where I don't really feel like having bloody locks but hey that's okay that's okay, indeed. I liked Inception. Let me just make that clear. I enjoyed it. Whoop. I don't think it's an impressive thing to get Inception. <laughs> that's that's the other thing I want to make clear. <laughs> Whoop. And there we are. This has been my this has been Inception cast. A podcast within a podcast. I uh, um, should we do it? No. All right. Well, well, we we could definitely find a secret room there, but apparently not. We now know that we can't. Secretly in the background, like we've been slowly picking up while well, thinking exclusively about how we are going to pivot this into a bomb run. We've been picking up like. The Exodia throw run, genuinely, like it's it's dirty, it's filthy, it's it's amazing. Um, what if today's the day? Today's the day. Uh, what if today is the day? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh god! Oh jeez! Oh man! Oh man! Oh no! Spatial sickness. Nope. All right. What if today is the day that uh, we actually are able to get Omegalol twice? I'm picking this up because I want to. I genuinely want to reduce the amount of bombs we have right now until we get the bomb immunity. This is not me making excuses for what I'm doing with my stupid value choices. This is me genuinely saying I have lost a run before to U235. That is how I lost my initial streak in this game of like 35 the first time I started streaking is because I blew myself up with a single bomb from U235. That is how I lost it. From full health to zero. Because we blew ourselves up. So I am not going to... Uh, that's why if you're wondering why I ain't being too risky with it. That is why, gang. I'm, I'm scarred. I'm emotionally scarred. Jeez. This is just, man, this is not gonna, this is not a bomb run. Watch, we're gonna get the, uh, we're gonna get our, sh our shrine. Oh no, teleport, tele, oh, spatial sickness on boss fight. Not good. The good news is this is not a hard fight. I will probably bomb him. 29. I'll probably bomb him. Not now. When the stinker moves around. Oh my god. Could you imagine if I just teleported into my bomb and died? 
I mean, we wouldn't because I've been uh, I've been good with my bombs. And making sure they are not too deadly at the moment. Currently, they, they just do 75 damage, which is a lot of damage. Don't get me wrong. It's a very large sum of damage. Whoa! <laughs> You can, I think you can probably see really easily there how spatial sickness can destroy a run. Alright. Did we use the shrine? We did use the shrine, so none of this even matters. I don't know. What is our Omega Lol chance? Who knows? I do not know how to calculate second Omega Lol chance because I genuinely have not looked into it because... I, other mine runs are so short compared to the regular run that getting a second Omega Lol is far more unlikely. I feel like if you get Omega Lol floor one or floor two, I, that is really obviously like the way. That is the way. Gives you the time. Like you just got to get lucky, really, really lucky on your first one, I think. I I could even be wrong. Like it genuinely, it genuinely could be hard coded that you only get one in other mine. I doubt it. Doesn't really sound like something the devs would do. Oh no. Oh la la. Okie dokie. Apoctic charm. No, thank you. I'll pick up a bomb. We're still we're 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 juggling it right. Ah oh, jeez. Yeah, I kind of wish that it wouldn't lock the doors. I mean, but I get it. Yeah. Fun thing is, uh, this is a bomb run where we don't need capture sphere for it to be good. In fact, that is a that is a critique I have as well is that the, the two like super logical bomb items have have counter synergy. Like it literally makes the other one have no value at all. Hell, give them a freaking synergy that just does something else. I don't know. Just uh, I don't know, man. The fact that two of the yeah, two of the best bomb run items literally make it so one of them has no value, like functionally doesn't do anything is it's a little disappointing. It's a little disappointing. <laughs> Wee! Wahoo! Waha! We have gold tooth. Nope. We do got gold dupe. The rock got in my way there. Oh, well. All right. I would like to get rid of bloody locks. It's... We have enough keys to be fine for a while, so, like, we should just... Use them? Is basically what I'm getting at. Oh, God. Yeah, see there? I would use keys there, but, you know, whatever. Ooh. Tis with tis. Sure, I guess. Helps me break gold easier. Okay. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Man. Do we buy all the healing in the shop? Because, yeah, Bloody Locks is actually messing me up right now. How could something I love so much do this to me? Just please, God. Or at least, like, clear them out. You know? Just, just like, clear them out when the old, uh, the old room's done. Am I wrong? They're just kind of annoying. Do we really want to spend 100 HP of our 189 to remove one of these two? I'm not going to say I really want to. God. But boy, I hate spatial sickness. Okay. All right. So, I'm happy. And, uh, it's weird. I'm happy that we got rid of that. But at the same time, I'm also like, oh boy, I really wish we also got rid of bloody locks instead. I, I do not like where we're at. This is nice. Here we go. 
What do we get rid of? Let's get rid of Bird Battle Axe. Sure. I'm gonna die. I'm telling you that right now. I didn't think I was going to earlier, but it is no longer earlier. Now it is now. Now it is now. Oh god. Where's that food? Okay, it's over there. We're getting it. All right, so we're, we're gonna we do good damage. We got great bomb damage, everything like that. Uh, in the in the near future, as soon as we start generating some and not wasting it, which may or may not happen. But as I mentioned in the background, we've just been getting one of the best exo throw run Exodia runs I've seen. So, ah, but of course, thank you. Life is easy now. Okay, bomb it up. Bomb it up, bomb it up, bomb it up, bomb it up. So now we do 90 damage per bomb. I think we want to hold off on really... Heck. I'm really using them, though. Ooh. I'll use it here. Because I want to... Uh, like, obviously, I want to go into a secret room. Uh, I don't want to use two bombs right now, though. Because if it's a, if it's for a situation that I... Okay, sure, fine. Yeah, why not? That I genuinely think will net me more bombs, then yeah, I want to do it. And all the while, it's us disrespecting the wonderful throw run that we've been just... That's literally just fallen on our lap. I want to see the big boom. Uh, what? It just kept on bouncing. It just kept on bouncing forever. The old ricochet uh, phantasmal axe meme dream. There's secret room here. Yep. Yep. Ah, but of course. I know we don't need to get away from it, but. Shoot. That'll work. Huh. We in there? <laughs> okay. Loop the loop. And pulled. Now your shoes are looking cool. I guess we will go down there to the left. We're missing an item room? No. Well, if we are, it's a four key room. Actually. Other mind eight. Do we get all of it? That's super worth it, right? That's a, that's a you know, it, it, obviously I lose a key. But, that's fine. What to sell? I'm sure we can find some value in selling something here. We don't really have a swing run, so the likelihood of us using the mirror is pretty low. I'm not going to say it's worthless, because we could totally get the, uh, the skull shield and we could get the synergy, which is a very, very good combo. But... I don't care. I'll cry when it uh, when it shows up and we don't get the synergy, but I won't even really because let's be honest, it's fine. It's fine. It's not like it's a big damage synergy; it's a survivability synergy. Pfft. That being said, it does it does improve your DPS because it does reflect more projectiles, especially on a throw run where you're not going to be doing the swings that would be uh, sending them back anyway. We can use this to open up a 200 uh, HP. What? 200 HP room. This is... That was... Brutal. But yeah, we can uh, we can basically sacrifice all kinds of HP. Antimatter and bloody blocks. Name a more iconic duo. I will not wait. Because it's a waste of time when you already know the answer. 
Yep, up, 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 up. All right. We will open this bad boy. We'll, we'll, we'll try to open as many as many bad boys as we can here. Schmoovin. 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 We're just ruining that guy's life over there with, a with just like accidental axes throwing at his face over there. Eh. I sleep. All right, for the throw run part of this run. Why not? We do 195 damage with our bombs. I like it. I like it. What am I doing? Why'd I do it? I don't know. Whatever. Okay. I kind of wanted to sacrifice more health so that this feels like a really cool big brain idea, you know? I know it's stupid. It's like, I want to be... I want to take all that damage just so that it feels like it's a cooler move. Not a good reason to do something. Not a good reason to do something. But we could have saved all that money, so, I mean... Do we remove bloody locks now and just make it so we open up that room normal style? No. Oh, hey, we took damage. Good. Good, good, good. Take more, take more. It'll feel so much smarter. Nice. Yeah, we, we do want to genuinely generate as much as possible now. Alright, we do have that still too, yeah, yeah. I got scared for a second that I was wrong about having bomb immunity. I just like, I never want to test it, you know? Because the moment you let your guard down is the moment you explode into a fiery blaze. Really? Really? Do we want to remove bloody locks? We have three keys right now. We have the mushroom, which is slowly generating us uh, extra max HP, which is pretty darn good. I don't care about bomb damage because U-235 makes it so bomb damage doesn't do anything. So why would I care? All right. There you go, video game. It's gone. Because none of the other options really seem that enticing to me. Uh, crit damage I is probably the best thing I could have taken there. Maybe, but we'll remove the uh, we'll remove my good old favorite curse. Truly, like Bloody Locks is genuinely one of my it's my it's probably my favorite curse, like right? Because it's bad in concept. If you're a new player, it's really bad. Cause you'll just like probably be way more likely to become deceased but if you are you know a player who's played the game for quite a while and you think you can like a lot of times health can be recovered at such a good pace that using it as a resource is really like a good way to generate a lot of power I want to get that dang orb back that's floating around there. There we go. We got it. All right. Just wanted to meme him. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's go. Increased fall damage. Yeah, sure. Actually, we don't even take it. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, then. Okie dokie. We still have our tent. Not going to use that for a hot moment at this rate. We are doing 
totally fine. Uh, Tuss, Tuss, nice, 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 nice. What would we want out of Tuss, huh? What would we want out of Tuss, huh? We're gonna get extra money there? Nope. I mean, uh, bomb doubler, bomb box, all of them. I'm trying. I'm genuinely, I'm trying. Okay, we did it. Against my better judgment. Like, also, let's be honest. Don't push me in the pit. Let's be honest. We can remove that, or we, we can pick that up because th we're not getting Omega Lol. Right? No way, Jose. How much damage does this do? 651. Ow. And we got ourselves bodied. All right, so I want to find the shop, like, ASA Pronto right now. So that we can spend all of our money. Do our backtracking. Oh, hello. Get it out of the way. Here, have a gift. Okay. Oh, man. Yeah, it's going to be some pretty extreme backtracking at this rate. This is actual hell. What was that? What was that shape? What was that shape? How does a mere mortal predict that shape to show up? Boop. All right. Yeah, I, I, I hate the style of backtracking that we've generated for ourselves here. But I just, this is the way I wanted to uh, do it. I want to go in here, spend as much money as we can on stuff that is hopefully going to be good for us. Yeah. Yeah. This stuff is good. We take those. Uh, yeah. And yeah. All right. Yeah, no, that's good. Then we go, then we go up. Two tusks. Go up two tusks. All the way up to Tuss. Yeah, we'll get that money on the way back. Give him half our money. Which one? I don't even remember which direction he was in. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah, yeah, oops. I almost gave him more than he's worth. Down bomb south. I cringe when he did not bomb this room the first time. Da -da 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 um. Yeah, okay. I I'll, I'll admit I was really hoping for a cool bomb related item. Cracked orb is really a fun one. Like don't, don't get me wrong, I see obsidian dagger. I see obsidian dagger. We just do it so much. We just do an obsidian. We do obsidian dagger runs all the time. Beep. And I'm don't get me wrong. I will do it again. But cracked orb is different. You know, we we don't really. I can't remember the last time we've used cracked orb. And it's really really good with this the the throw run we have generating. And it does make it so enemies take more damage from the bombs if we throw our pickaxe at them with the. Get him cracked orbed up. That should work for both. What have I done? <laughs> I was trying to get one of those to potentially drop something cool. Alright, move it, move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I've not even mentioned the Firebird like once. I don't think today. I mentioned it right away when I des was deciding if I was doing a swing or a throw run. But that's just kind of his thing, you know? Like, unless we're really trying to outrageously utilize his fire by going, like, getting Salamander's Pale, all of that, everything, just like... Then it's not super likely. I think we can do better. We can do better. <laughs> oh, no. All of that, and we didn't even get an item. We didn't even get an item. I'm not going to use them. 
Do not worry. I, I you know, like, I don't pick them up for a reason. <laughs> you know? I've, it's because I just, the back seating when I get them is so annoying that I just don't want them. I genuinely would rather not have them. I don't need them. Like, I don't, I don't need the, the cheaty, cheating strats of hovering over pits and throwing pickaxes from untouchable places. I don't, I don't need that cheese to win, so I, excuse me. Excuse me. But, hey. Run's almost done. Other mine 11. One more floor after this. And we are good to go. I do want to start throwing some bombs. I, I was definitely hoping that this uh, would be a little bit more bomb-centric. But if we just start throwing out bombs, our bombs are not going to do very much damage. 195, genuinely, is not that impressive. Genuinely not that impressive. Like... It's good damage, but I think we're going to need, like, 20, 30 bombs before, like, it, it's actually kind of worth utilizing. I'm basically just saving up so that when we get to the boss, we do silly damage with bombs there. That's my my current hope of the moment. Having Cirque du Soleil is also making us... Utilize our bombs to uh, get into secret rooms, which is which is good. And I think the proper thing to do in the scenario we have before us. But. Oh, there's a curse tag in here. Well, boy, howdy. Well, boy, howdy. You're duller than a broken sandwich. Okay. Okay. Good, 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 good. Oh, good. Why do I want to be in the middle here? I guess because those guys are just going to fall into the pit by themselves. I'm trying to pull them in. Like that other guy. Why did, I want, why did that guy on the right fall in? Is it because there's like a rock by the pit? Is that what it is that is pushing them in sometimes? All right. All right. Ideal room. Just a bunch of tiny enemies. Super ideal. For all kinds of reasons. Like, it also helps with mushroom, you know? You guys can... Eh. He's gonna let them have it, but... But alas... Or Yeah, this run is uh Uh Slapper. Speaking of speaking of Should we just double our bombs now so we can try to actually utilize our our backyard bomb run? Or back bomb back burner back burner bomb run? There we go. Bomb run on the back burner. It's a, it's a very, like, it's definitely throw run Exodia with a back burner bomb run, but the bomb run is, is never quite taking off. I think that kind of what I want to do is just generate as much uh, bombs as we can. And then blow up the boss with them. I think that's where I'm at. I will pick up everything I can. Oop. I couldn't even I couldn't hear that guy's giggling. I couldn't hear it over my uh my chaos. Alright. Okay. <laughs> Four leaf clover. Obviously, uh, obviously best to get on the very final floor where I can't utilize all the money. Boy. Boy. It's definitely one of those items where uh, getting it late just is 
It ain't no thing, man. No bombs. Yeah, I mean, we'll get up to 30 at this rate, which is actually, like, uh, it's a substantial amount of bombs. Like, it should give us, we should be doing 400-ish damage. If we uh, cracked Orbum first, they should take, like, 500. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. Fine, 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 fine. You better give me bombs. Them's ain't bombs. Those have such a low payout. If keys are so valuable, why the hell, man? This is, this, is, this is dumb. I'm just doing it just to do it, basically. I know the devs know how valuable keys are. Why make those have one of the worst payouts? Know what I'm saying? Okay. E Macarena. Hi. Okay. <laughs> I really want to bomb these guys so bad. so bad they take so much extra damage from bombs it's so satisfying to do but every bomb we place every move we make we'll be losing to a hey. all right well all right tis with tis with tis with tis with tis we shall dupe the bombs we do 390 what if more though let's go it's nori okie dokie more like Snorri. Or if I was a Canadian, I'd say uh, more like Sorry, because you're going to get blown the hell up. Yep, that's nice. Oh! I got got by myself. <laughs> eh, you know, all things considered, hit me. All things considered, it was, um, you know, it was definitely more of a... <laughs> throw run. <laughs> it was not a bomb run <laughs> in any way. But we certainly tried. Oh, Bingus Town, USA. What kind of title do I give to Bingus? Bingus Town, USA. <laughs> oh my God, Bingus Town, USA. The Inceptor. That is you. That is because <laughs> you had a run within a run. Oh, get it? Thank you everybody for watching. Greatly appreciate any and all support you wish to leave on the series up to this point. Patreon.com slash retromation link at the top of the description if you want to get your name on a peasant. Anybody at the $5 here or higher gets the name, and they get a title at the end of the episode, and you get to support my channel. Help until I get to keep on doing this for a long time to come. Thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.